What's up everybody, Nick here with TACFORM. To all the truckers out there looking for a solid tablet mount built to handle the nastiest of roads, gaping potholes, and engine vibration, look no further. I'll start with a quick compatibility once over, then a deep dive into each component, outlining what really makes this product stand out from the rest. The spring-loaded tablet cradle will hold just about anything out there. This mount is paired with a seven inch long, all metal, indestructible arm, and a super universal cup holder mounting base. This is our universal tablet holder. There's three things that really stand out to me about this cradle. Number one, the amps interface. You see a lot of different connection types and interfaces on the back of these tablet cradles, but amps is arguably the most secure, reliable, and universal. There's also a lot of great amps compatible accessories out there. Number two, it's ultra light. The first thing you notice when you grab this cradle is its weight. This is not typically what you'd expect of a tack form product. However, this isn't just any plastic. It's automotive grade ABS that's been life cycle tested and durability tested in a wide range of harsh environments. Now, why is this not metal? We do have metal options out there, but we found it's best to keep the weight down on the holder when mounting heavy devices. It puts less strain on the suction cup, cup holders, and dashboards. The quality is great, it's very dependable and affordable in comparison to all metal alternatives. Number three, compatibility. This unique design has interchangeable legs as well as a few inches of range on the spring-loaded side. This will hold just about any tablet on the market under one inch thick, from iPad mini to iPad 12.9 even with large protective cases. And the same goes for Samsung Galaxy tablets and many ELD devices. Between the spring-loaded cradle and the different arm options, you can grab your tablet in a multitude of different ways depending on what type of tablet you have. You can rest assured that it will still hold securely whether you're grabbing it from the top or from the sides. TACFORM has a huge range of arm options in different lengths as well as materials, including carbon fiber, tubular aluminum, and cast aluminum. For commercial applications, we always recommend the cast aluminum, and here's why. Reason number one, the dovetails at the end of the middle arm segment are all one piece, compared to a carbon arm where we have to glue and screw the dovetail into the end, which in rare cases, under just the right conditions, can fail, while the cast aluminum arm never fails. Reason number two, this arm has a locking elbow mechanism that makes it incredibly convenient when getting the product positioned exactly where you'd like. Another feature is the ability to increase and decrease the overall arm length, as you can see here. Lastly, you'll notice two independent articulating sockets that can lock firmly into place with little or no chance of slippage. Here's our 20 series cup holder mounting base. 20 series simply means it's compatible with all of our 20 millimeter ball and socket parts. This measures about five and a half inches from the bottom of your cup holder to the center of the ball. This is designed for vehicle cup holders with a three inch minimum diameter and a maximum diameter of three and five eighths. This covers the vast majority of cup holders out there, so we categorize this item as a universal item, but you may want to measure and check. The real determining factor of how this will perform for you is the cup holder itself in your vehicle. Large rectangular shaped cup holders with a divider in the middle typically don't perform great. A nice circular cup holder that's rigid traditionally performs incredibly well. To install this, you simply place the mounting base in your cup holder and twist this ring which will expand the legs, locking it into place. Thank you for taking the time out to watch this video. I hope it helped answer any questions you have. If you do have additional questions, feel free to uh, mention them in the Q&A and we'll get back to you as soon as possible, or you could contact our friendly support staff. Thanks again.